Hmm. You know, Shinnok. Maybe we were wrong about you being a, a shitty villain. Nah. Okay, so there you get a glimpse of Shinnok's demon form. And that is, uh... Hmm. That is a... Kind of... Easter egg. Well, not even an Easter egg. He had that form in Mortal Kombat Mythologies. He transformed into that. He was the final boss, but you didn't actually fight and beat him. We'll enter the Sky Temple from the terrestrial entrance. Why not go straight there? It exists in a different quantum state, slightly out of phase from our reality. It can't be reached by conventional means. <sighs> what? It's just us. No one's coming to help. We either pull this off. We or... will get it done. Hmm. You tell him, Cassie. By the. What is that? Don't know, but it's headed <clears throat> right for us. All their gods have mercy. Buckle up, people. I gotta put her down. Looks like the temple entrance is. Oh, sorry. Hold on. Why won't I re? Oh. Hold on. We're having technical difficulties here. It won't reconnect for some reason. Why is that? Okay. Oh crap! Don't know, but it's headed right for us. All their gods have mercy. <laughs> Buckle up, people. I gotta put her down. Looks like the temple entrance is 15 clicks that way. Moonlight walk in the woods. Another time, it'd be relaxing. I wouldn't have pegged you for outdoorsy. My mother and I live near a forest a lot like this. Really takes me back. After we wrap this up, we should go. Look at that. Putting the moves on <laughs> each other. Grounded. That shockwave fried the leads. Then let's get going. <clears throat> We're almost out of time. Oh, hey, Kotal Khan. What are they doing here? Looking for the amulet, I bet. We have to tell them about Shinnok. Call a truce. Bring them to me! Alright. Or not. The woods. Come on. Stay quiet. Sneaky. Hmm. They're back. We sense them. But the forest teens the souls. Yes. <clears throat> so close. Ooh. That's rough. Look out! Oh, you might be blind like your dad. You hurt him. You answer to me. Mm. All right. So now we are Jackie Briggs, who I also have no idea how to use whatsoever. You would think something like that would be a launcher, but I guess not. Let's see, that's an overhead. And I'm guessing we'd probably be able to run out of that, maybe? I don't know. I don't even know what our moves are, to be honest. All I know is that full auto, the full auto variation, is like super annoying to fight against. What is what are even our moves? What did that do? Like, I don't even know. So anyway, Jackie Briggs, I am not a big fan of her as a character. 
But, uh, you know, I guess people liked her enough that they brought her back. She does have a cool x-ray, though, I will say. Although, I'm not too big on her redesign, much like Jax. And I know that's gonna sound pretty racist because they're both black, but... You know, in the effort of uh, making myself innocent, I quite like the way Jade looks, so it's it's definitely not the blackness. It's... I'm just digging that hole deeper. <laughs> I don't know. It, my main problem with her is she just looks completely different. She looks like a completely different character. Like, come. Clean your head back. It's just weird. You know? Can you see? Yeah, yeah it's, it's fuzzy, but. Better? Oh. Beautiful. Gotta build up that romance. Too bad you're not in the next game, Takeda. <laughs> Hold that thumb. I've got our Mac. Ooh. You spawn a giant <coughs> race. And damn proud of it. I know what you did to him. We took your father's arms. We will take all of you. Damn. He's gonna take all of you. Every little bit, Jackie. Uh all right, Jackie, we're gonna look at the woos list here. Oh, you got a lot of back forwards, okay. Oh, what do you got? Is that a dash punch? You just have... How does that move even work? Oh, that's an interesting move. All right, Mac, please stop. I just want to hit you. And then you had a back forward to circle. That must be that. Hit him with that. Alright. Ermac, you're starting to test my patience here. Thank you. Come strong or not at all. Okay, alright. I see how it is. I see how it is, Ermac. Damn it. Maybe if I bounce? No. Oh, we almost had it. Yeah, just meet her through it. Next time I block. Run and tell your mom about that. Yeah. You tell her. You tell him. You tell everyone. I don't know. For you, Dad. Listen, if I know this game's plot, Takeda's probably getting bodied by Cold Khan right now. Because if it's not the character you're playing as. They absolutely suck and will get beat up by everyone. Squeeze, squeeze, Tor. Your eyes, so bright. Gonna carve them out. Ooh. Trickery, deceit. No more tricks. Just a straight up beatdown. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Oh, I guess it went pretty well. There we go. We're just gonna keep spamming that move. Not really, Jackie. I will be honest. I don't really like how you play. And again, I don't really like how most people play in the- Like, this game is literally the opposite of Mortal Kombat 9 for me. Like, I quite enjoyed 
most of the cast in MK9. In this game, I really only liked a few characters. Sub-Zero, one of them, until they started messing around with his moves. Uh, I liked Aaron Black. I played as... Aaron Black, I guess, was the closest to being my second main. I messed around with Liu Kang and Kung Lao as well, though they were pretty fun. I did play a tiny bit with Scorpion and a tiny bit with Takeda, but decided I wasn't really too big on them, so I didn't really advance much with them. So yeah. Oh, and I messed around a little bit with Cassie Cage too, because I had a friend who was interested in learning Cassie Cage who was new to fighting games, so I kind of learned a little bit with her to teach them it, but... Where I probably have no memory of any of it. Khan, the situation has changed. <laughs> Do not fling your spittle at me. Yeah, don't fling your spittle. <clears throat> you tell him? Not yet. He needs to know Busy. that- I will kill you both. Shinnok's been freed. He's at Raiden's Sky Temple. He's already infected Earthrealm's life force. The heavens boil. Earthrealm is lost. Not if we hang together. I will appease Shinnok. Bring him your heads. Gain time to bolster Outworld's defenses. That's a little brash, Kotal Khan. I mean, it's a, actually not a bad plan, but it's a little brash. You need to help us, Kotal Khan. It is too late for Earthrealm. Shinnok is now its master. Oh, not necessarily. There's still another chapter left. Ow. Oh, hey, we actually comboed into it that time. What does that move even do? I don't even know. That's alright, we'll just spam. We gotta be careful, because Cold Khan's got his X-Ray, and the AI is usually not afraid to use it. There we go. Oh, no bounce. We weren't close enough. Alright, alright. Kulkan, please. Alright. Ow. There we go. Meter through it. That's all you gotta do sometimes, is just meter through it. You get no sympathy points. So sassy. For no reason. You should have been with us. That's oh, hey, Aaron Black, you here to lose again? <laughs> I hope he gets a chapter in the new game, and he doesn't suffer the same fate as Ermac and Reptile. He's a cool concept for a character that they just didn't use well in this game. Don't know about you guys, but I'm living the dream. You have our dreams. Chateau, you die tonight. Oh, look who came to save the day! It's a Sub-Zero! <clears throat> you stood together against formidable odds. Lesser warriors would not have fared so well. Thanks, Grandmaster. I will remain here to push Kotal Khan back to Outworld. Proceed to the Sky Temple. Earthrealm's fate lies with you. 